Oh, yeah, okay. Wherever you like. Got the way she sits. There we go. Well, I can also look at a transformer. I miss TV. It feels like forever since we had electricity. I'm trying to think how old she is. Eleven? Hey souls, how's it going? Talk to Kenny or offer him the the drink. Talk to him first. There, there, little guy. Shh. Shh, I got you. I got you. Hey. Oh, hey, Clem. Just uh needed some air. Kenny, there's air everywhere. <laughs> I'm sorry for, for how I acted back there after Sarita was I just I, I couldn't handle it. I'm sorry. I mean you did what you could. You tried to help, and I blamed you for it. I'm so so sorry. I I could have done more. I'm not sure, oh, dude. Don't say that. Probably did not for a while. Could. I'm sorry if anything I said made you feel any different than that. It just makes me feel awful. I know I can be a real shit sometimes. Stop. <laughs> no, it's true. But I. It's not that I don't want to do the game. It's I the fact I've got boy. so many games I him so much. that I want to cover as well. I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Wasn't there a whole lot for a couple years. Off on a boat somewhere or other. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him. From my family. But I'd give anything for one more second with them. To play catch with Doug. To touch Koch's face. Anything in the world. I miss Doc too. He was a good friend, and I haven't had too many of them. He was a good boy. Pure. Just wanted folks to be happy, that's all. Boy like that. Thrown into a world like this. Mm. It's gonna be different with him. He's gonna get raised right. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. You should get back over by the fire. What about you? Ain't no sense in both of us being over here. I can handle watch on my own. You should come too. I don't know. Come on. It'll be good for everyone. Yeah, okay. Oh wow, I convinced him without using the alcohol. Nice. Yeah. I mean, I have a feeling I still have to talk with Arvo. <laughs> or maybe not. Jane, you don't have to justify that with a response. Hey, I find it's best to just get this stuff out in the open. Less drama. Well, that's fine. But I can confirm there was no time for kissing. Yeah. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> Alright, enough of that. Hey, you Clem. It's nice to hear people laughing. Alright. It is. It's been a while since we heard that. Spend so much time trying to stay alive that you don't get a chance to enjoy living. Yeah. We need to make more time for that. Hmm. Alcohol helps. <laughs> Hell yeah, it does. I thought I could hear it. A noise of, like, somebody crying. Let me get that bottle. We got someone else that might need some help. Sounds like a waste of good rum. He lost his sister today. And whose fault was that? That makes it even harder to deal with. Trust me. Kenny, please, don't let it ruin a nice night. I said my piece. I mean, I can't understand. I don't think that boy's a bad person. I just think good people do bad things sometimes. And they do it a lot more nowadays with the world being what it is. Hmm. So I think it's best. Leave me alone! Oh dear. Sorry. Okay. My fault. I shouldn't have. Leave me alone! 
you trying to draw walkers to us? It's okay. It's okay. Oh, maybe all right. it's best if we all get some rest. Who knows how long walk we got tomorrow? Yeah, that's a good idea. I'll take first watch. Thank you, Kenny. Really. I uh, no, don't mention it. <laughs> you did good. It was nice while it lasted. Yep, the whole ten seconds. Uh, woo! Nothing good lasts forever. Forever. <laughs> forever. Especially in this kind of world. Whoa! Where the hell are we? Wait, seriously, where, where's everybody else? Okay, cool. All I could see was Clem, so I'm like, what's sure happened? Good. Yeah, yeah, I'm good. If I, if I start to crap out, I'll let you know. Okay, will you do that? It's no trouble. At least he's able further. to walk. Close. Very close. You've been saying that every time I ask. Please. Oh, shoot. I'm really starting to think you're full of shit. Uh. Kenny, look out! What the fuck? Oh, no. Oh, dear. Whew. Jesus Christ. Damn. I don't know why I didn't use the, like, the pick. Came out of nowhere. That was real loud. Hopefully there aren't more of them. Yeah, well, let's move. We don't want to be around to find out. It's very close. Come. Whew. <laughs> no worry, Fripta. How's it going? And then more of them. That piece of shit is half built. Still a house. Well, half a house. We're here for the supplies, not the house. It's warm. Fireplace. Very warm. Mm. I'd just like a place to sit, if I'm honest. As long as there's food, who cares what it looks like? You're not gonna think that when you wake up with a couple inches of snow covering you. Probably. That's a good point. Are we just gonna walk over? Ooh. Maybe there's a way around. In the icy river. Great. Можно идти. Там твёрдый лёд. Say it in American asshole. It's okay. Walk. Ice. No shit ice. That's the problem. He's saying it's fine. Run across. Yep. I go first. I can be front. Maybe we shouldn't clump together. We just can't have too much weight. She's right. We need to spread out. Just to be safe. Less weight the better. Let the Rusky go first, since he's so confident. He's okay. I love how that's all he said. He's okay. It's just like his go-to <laughs> phrase. He's okay. Oh god. When is shit gonna go south? Ooh. I'm just waiting to see it crack. I mean, I don't like the noises I'm hearing. We making it? Oh god, we're not even halfway. Oh no. And Luke's kind of dragging behind. Uh oh. We're okay. Don't worry. Ooh. Oh no. Where'd they come from? They weren't there a second ago. We got some walkers behind us. There's only few of them. Should be all right. Oh, but if they clump together. Hey, stay with us. He's speeding up. Oh no. That's too less to deal with. We'll just stay spread out and we'll be fine. Hey, he's running. Motherfucker. Shit, he's gonna kill him. God, Get back here. But they're all running. Uh, oh god. I think he was running because he's scared. Made it across. 
Yay! Well, they made it. Oh, good. Oh no. Um. Don't come over here. Hey, I can make it. It's it's fine. You sure? Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. Stop. Stop. I'm fine. I'm fine. No, you're not. I just gotta pull myself out. Uh oh. You need help, Luke. The ice is too thin. I got it. You need to help. No. Clem, go. go through. Oh, no, fuck. Him. No, Clem, Clem, do not. Just go back for him. You're lying. You, you Stop do telling it. her that. Clem, look at me. Pull out your gun and shoot those damn walkers, okay? Just give me a little time. Clem, you can make it, but you need to go. No. Now. Clem, it's too dangerous. He's going to yeah, die, I just need Clem. some more time. He's going to die. I can fall through. I can figure it out. Clem. Clementine, stop. Clementine. I want to help Luke. See, look, it's fine. It's not too light. Too it's light, too bad. thin. We got you. Oh, I can hear it cracking, though. Oh no. Oh, fuck. Oh, great. Oh, oh, shite. Oh no. Wait, how are they alive? I guess they don't drown. I'll knock the fucker off. Thank you. Oh, well, Clementine's able to hold her breath for a real long time. There he goes. Oh no. Ah, oh. that's a real crappy. Oh no! Oh, fuck. He quite literally yeah, just got. I got you. Come on, come on, you're gonna be okay. Go. He just got dragged to the bottom of the abyss. Oh my god, Clementine's like as pale as I am. Whew. Oh my. Oh no. There's a fireplace. Jesus Christ. Wait, what about the walkers? We have to get her warm. She's gonna freeze to death. Ooh. God, look at her. She's just gone. Looks fucking gone. We should have gone around. God damn it. We should have just fucking gone around. God damn it. I tried to help him. I just. That I started to go, there wasn't nothing any of us could do. Mm hmm. He wasn't in a shape to run. He just. Oh, God. You son of a bitch! This is your fucking fault! Kenny! Don't, man! Don't what? It's nobody's damn fault! The hell it ain't! I'm freezing. Can we just get a fire started? <laughs> yes, please. Just a stack of fucking toothpicks. Bet those magical supplies are bullshit too. What? No speaking of English? Fuck you. Oh dear. You fucking commie piece of shit. Oh dear. Fuck you. You wonder. Fuck what the fuck, Kenny? Shit. Whoops. Just stop. There we go. Oh my god. He's what? really fucked up. Lose your taste for this sort of thing. Bit different. Another just like it. He wasn't lying. Oh dear. You want to tell me how a 
can of fucking chili. It's gonna help How is baby. beating a kid to death gonna help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know it. I don't want everybody to turn on Kenny. I'm tying him up. Fine. Mike, help me get a fire started. You okay? He's hurt real bad. Mike! Yeah. Yeah, okay. The fire. Uh, Sheesh. You got a light? Yeah, he really just has it in for oh, Clementine. Just... Is it all just because he shot his sister? Her... Wait, she shot his sister. It's like it's not like it was her fault. She was a walker. I had no choice. Ah. Oh. Hey, Clem's not gonna freeze. Good stuff. Oh my. And yeah, he's gonna be like glaring over at Clem. Sheesh. What a douche. It's not Clem's fault. Arva would have probably preferred he didn't shoot. Take a look at you, kid. Oh, she didn't shoot his sister, Jesus. and instead he could have killed you. The fuck is wrong with him? Got bit. Yep. Kenny's out back, trying to get some stupid truck started. Here, you should eat something. You okay? Thank you. Hmm. I can't believe he's gone. Yep. I've lost people before, but... It just hasn't felt this... this shitty in a while. He cared about you too, Jane. I know he did. God damn it. Hm. So she did have feelings for him. I shouldn't have come back. I knew this would happen. I knew it. <sighs> Always does. Yep. Well, I'm glad you did. Find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. I can't take this shit anymore. Great. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. Mm hmm. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This house ain't worth a crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up. Be out of here by nightfall. Yeah, sure, Kenny. That's the spirit, darling. I'll wait for you out back. Yeah, I'll be fine. I'll watch him. Okay. We're gonna say, are we gonna put on our vest thing or not? It's Kenny, he ain't gonna do anything. Hmm. Although one thing I'm really noticing with this game is how stiff everybody's movements seem to be. They're not bad, it's just some movements are very stiff. What did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Kenny. <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, alright? Mm-hmm. Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. Oh, yeah. Okay, so what are we doing? Had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. He was a mean son of a bitch, but he taught me respect. 
girl like Jane could learn a thing or two about that. Hmm. We're all just tired. Hell, I've been tired for two years. All right, give it a turn. All right. Up. And whoosh. We're so close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running. And then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Wellington's got to be out there. Now, those rumors can't all be bunk. What about Mexico? I mean, hell, there's got to be something out here other than snow and goddamn Euro trash. Sounds good to me. We're going to make it, Clem. I know it. Hmm. All right, turn it again. All right. Oh, it says Mexico on there. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it. <sighs> we'll get it working. We got to get moving if we're going to keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I got to get this thing to start. I'm gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. Ah, uh, oh my. Whoa. Look at our face. That's what I said, is it wanted me to move? Well, that's Bonnie. Oh, look, an excavator. Or what I would call a digger. <laughs> Wait, stop, drop, blue Ford lumber. That looks like a really weird put together house. Wish they'd finished this place. Yeah, may have been a viable option then. Oh well. Talk to Barney. Is she having a smoke? Yes yeah, she is. Want one? Hmm. No thanks. I don't know why the hell you'd take Do that you offer. Remember when you saw me first? Back at the lodge? Mm-hmm. I felt real bad you believed me. She can't hurt anyone. So we're reminiscing about our choices with Bonnie. You ever done something you regret? Even if it's something you knew you had to do. Ooh. Oh. Go on. You can be honest. I wish I'd never looked for my parents. Because she found them. You know. There's walkers. I'll say one thing about Luke. No matter where you end up, there's always one bad seed rocking the boat. But I don't think he would have ever been that guy. Let me ask you something, Clem. When's the last time anyone did what you wanted? Hmm. I don't really know what I want. Maybe I ought to start thinking about it. Maybe. It's not the case you know, of no I've one listens. Over, run with a lot of people, a lot of men, and listen to a lot of promises. Ain't one of them come true. I'm starting to think there might be another way, you know? I'm gonna go take a piss. Have fun. Oh yeah, I was gonna say, it's not the fact that nobody ever listens to Clem. Or that everybody respects her, it's, it's a bit of both. Like some people show her the respect she deserves, but they also treat her like she's a kid, because she is a kid. But in this kind of scenario, it doesn't, it doesn't matter. Like what, whether you're a child or not. Hey. Oh, he's there. Mike and Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! 
Yeah. Seen that look before. Son of a bitch. Mm. Oh, damn it. He'll be fine. Clem, he beat that boy within an inch of his life. We are way past fine. I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy too. Once. Probably had a nice job and a nice pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. I mean, they're not the same. Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, we're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. God, the fancy man. Something. Uh. Yeah, the faces. He just pulls some right faces, doesn't he? Hey! Shut right up. Seems like you've done that before. Uh Hmm. I guess we're getting close. I guess so. That's what worries me. What? Do you not want Clem to look after him? Or something? I was running with some people a long time ago, down near DC. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. He was a douchebag. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we got him out. Oh. Yeah, I think what she's trying to get at is B. All that for one person? That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turn and rip the neck right out of this old lady. Oh, great. The look on her face was... She was just staring up at the sky. Like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. Oh my god, he did it. He got it working. Oh, wow. Well, he did it. Go, Kenny! Oh my. The plan. How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? Not much. We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, someplace warm. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're gonna freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? What the hell? Just an idea. We already talked about this. I'm sorry. We did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Kenny, it's freezing up here, man. It's only gonna get worse. We came this far. We're not going back. Nah, man. This is fucking nuts. I'm with Kenny. We should head north. Goddamn right. Clem. My friend Krista. She told me about Wellington a long time ago, Jane. It's out there. Everybody was on about Wellington. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got of helping AJ. What about Arbo? Who? Oh, the Rusky? Yeah, he ain't coming with us. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. He could die. Better him than another no, one. I'm not saying anything. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh yeah, some help he's been. He got Luke killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation, but maybe if you'd eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. You ever think about that, Kenny? Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus I agree. Christ. 
Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. Wait, what actually happened last time they had a car? A working car? God damn it! Kenny, are you okay? I don't actually remember what happened we, when we had the last when we last had a working car. I don't remember when that would have been. The RV? Is that what he's meaning? You better talk some sense into him. For his sake. Would it have been the RV? Because I mean that got not really stolen, but Well no, it got stolen if you kept Lily with you. God damn it. God damn it! That stupid fucking Get the fuck out of here! It's me! Clem! Sorry, just give me a second. What's he doing? Close the door. Can you believe this, Clem? I bring them a working truck, and they act like I just shit in their cereal. I knew Jane would have a stick up her ass, but I thought at least Mike would have more sense. He's turned out to be a real disappointment. I don't understand them either. I know. I know, Clem. Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Hmm. Clem, think about Rebecca and Alvin. I mean... What if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. We owe it to them to see this done. I know. You're right. Someone's got to keep this group together. That kid's depending on us. <sighs> I wish Lee was here. Mm-hmm. What you think he'd say? Ooh. Oh god, I don't know. I think he'd tell me that he doesn't have all the answers. We can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew, and what people like Jane won't ever understand. Look, I know Wellington might be bullshit. But where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? Yeah. You know, when I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when you sat with those people at dinner, well, I knew you were growing up. And yeah, I felt sad, but also pride. Pride I hadn't felt in a long time. <laughs> but I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. It's the only chance that child has. We'll find it. Something has to be out here. We'll find it, Kenny. I knew I could count on you, Clem. Look, we'll figure everything out in the morning. Come on, let's get some sleep. No, oh, so okay. Be ready. It was different. <laughs> Yeah, just a little. You're just going into the truck just to have a word. Alright. the hell can I hear? Something thumping against the side of the house? Oh. Yeah. And they're just smacking against it. Why is there a ladder? Unless they were probably already there, actually. Ooh. Well, that's Mike. And Bonnie. Who's there? 